The aircraft in front of which I'm standing is an Avro-built CF-100. The CF-100 is distinguished as the only Canadian designed jet fighter to enter mass production. Designed immediately after the Second World War, it was intended by Avro Canada to meet an Air Force demand for a jet fighter interceptor capable of all weather, long range missions. Early prototypes were engined by Rolls Royce, but production models featured various marks of the domestically designed and manufactured Avro Orenda. General production began at the Avro factory in Moulton, Ontario in 1952 and continued until 1981. Almost all of the 692 aircraft built served the Royal Canadian Air Force, Belgium being the only foreign purchaser, taking 53. The CF-100, officially called the Canuck, was also known by its crews as the Clunk, believed to be related to the noise its nose wheel made entering its housing. Never designed to be supersonic, with its straight-edged wing, it cruised at Mach 0.85, or 1,000 km an hour, 635 miles per hour. However, in early testing, one pilot reached Mach 1.1 in a dive, without upset or incident. This particular aircraft was intended for Belgian service in 1958, when a landing accident sent it for repair. It later entered service with the RCAF and flew until 1980 when it went into storage at Mountain View near uh, Trenton, Ontario, only to be resurrected as a gate guardian by the Royal Military College class of 1982 and placed beside the Kingston Military Community Sports Centre, where it now stands, bearing the markings of 414 Electronic Warfare Squadron, the unit in which it had spent most of its 1588 flying hours. If you found this video interesting, please consider liking and subscribing to this channel.